Welcome to AIM Under 5, a series of video briefs produced by the Maine AIM program. The topic of this AIM Under 5 is steps to providing AIM for students with disabilities. If you're an educator in Maine, you may have noticed that the state's IEP form makes reference to AIM. In Section 3, Part D, there's a question that reads, does the child have a print disability that requires AIM to access the curriculum? Followed by, if yes, what type of AIM does the student require? The origin of AIM in the IEP form is the 2004 Reauthorization of the Individuals with Disabilities Education Act, or IDA 04. Within the Act, there's a provision for AIM, stating that students with print disabilities require access to the same course materials as other students in the specialized formats they need in a timely manner to make progress in the general education curriculum. Three key words appear in the provision and help guide a student's educational team in the process of understanding AIM in the IEP. Print disabilities, specialized formats, and timely manner. Let's begin with print disability. Consider a standard print book. What are the abilities that a student needs to learn or gain information from this book? For example, can the student adequately see the text and other content on his pages? Hold the book and turn its pages. Does the student have the necessary physical stamina to read for required periods of time, such as sitting upright and staying alert? Can the student decode letters and words and read with fluency? If the answer is no to one or more of these questions, the student may have a print disability and need the book in a specialized format. For example, would the student be able to read the book if it were available in digital text, which can be spoken aloud through widely available, low-cost and no-cost technology? Or perhaps the student could access the book if provided in a human narrated audio recording, or large print, or braille. These are the four specialized formats of AIM. Finally, timely manner means the student who needs AIM receives material in the required format at the same time that other students receive the standard version. An educational team can accomplish the AIM provision in IDEA in four steps. First, determine if the student needs AIM. Second, Select the appropriate format of formats based on the student's needs and preferences. Third, acquire the material in the specialized format. And finally, support the student, teachers, other related school staff, and family with the use of the material with assistive technology, or AT. A team, including the student, determines if AIM is needed by asking the essential question, can the student access and learn from standard print materials? If the answer is no, the team moves on to select the specialized format or formats that the student needs, recalling that the four formats are digital text, audio, large print, or braille. Acquisition requires the team to know the primary sources of textbooks and core curriculum materials in each of the four specialized formats. The largest collection for digital text materials is Bookshare at bookshare.org. Human Narrated Audio is available from Learning Ally at learningally.org. And Large Print and Braille are both produced by Catholic Charities Maine at ccmaine.org. Students will need AT to use AIM. Bookshare, Learning Ally, and Catholic Charities all provide or assist users with compatible software apps and devices. The educational team needs to coordinate support and training to use the AT for the student, teachers, any related school staff, as well as the family. All together now, the four steps of providing AIM are to determine the student's need, select the appropriate format or formats, acquire the material, and support the student, teachers, and family with the AT the student will need to be successful with AIM. For technical assistance, please contact the Maine AIM program. We serve schools throughout the state and look forward to the opportunity to support you. Our website is maine-aim.org. Our email address is info at maine-aim.org or you can call us at 207-621-3195. Thank you for watching this AIM Under 5 video brief by the Maine AIM program. We hope it was helpful on your journey to successful AIM implementation.